what are these spots cropping all over my face is it something i should be worried about help hello everybody welcome to dr k explains it all the youtube channel that aims to educate you on your health journey and arm you with a barrel load of information so you can make better decisions about your health welcome to my second video in the series on skin problems Throughout this video, I'm helping you to understand more about common issues that affect black skin. For the full playlist, click the icon over here to the right. And if you want to subscribe to be alerted on when I release new videos, then click the subscribe button down here somewhere. You get extra bonus feel good points if you do. All right then, so in my first video, I talked about how black people can get skin cancer, although it's much more rare so let's move on to the actual question you want answered which is what the heck are these spots i've got on my face you might have noticed that you or people that you know have these small brown or black spots they're usually around the eye area or the cheekbones but can also be on other parts of the face the neck the chest and the back some people may just have one or two, but others literally have hundreds. These spots are called, now wait for it, dermatosis papulosa nigra. But I'm going to refer to them as DPN, rolls off the tongue, much easier. This condition is not cancer or a sign of a serious medical problem. So let's all breathe a sigh of relief. However, it can be incredibly annoying for those who have them. Sometimes they can be itchy, they can get irritated by rubbing on clothing or jewellery, or you may just be bothered by the fact that you have them and they're there. It's something that's definitely more common in black skin, especially if you're darker in complexion. Women are also much more likely than men to get this condition. These spots generally appear after puberty and grow in size and number with age. The most famous person that I know with this condition is the actor Morgan Freeman. Now, for those of you wondering about the outlook for this condition, I have some bad news, I'm afraid. And that is, this condition generally tends to get worse as you get older. And once these spots have come up, they don't tend to shrink or disappear on their own without treatment sad times now here's the thing modern medical science is amazing but the truth is we actually still don't know what causes dpn and why it's more common in black skin now if you think you're ahead of the curve and you have your own theory about why it happens then feel free to post them in the comments below Although DPN is not a dangerous medical condition, some people may not like the look of them and choose to have them removed purely for this reason. If you are considering treatment, then you need to be realistic. This is because the treatments available tend to focus more on minimizing the appearance of these spots rather than clearing them or eradicating them completely. The other thing that you need to be realistic about is the very real possibility that you might have scarring or pigmentation issues after treatment. What you need to bear in mind is that in black skin, after any cut or injury, whether it's due to an accident or having a medical procedure done, our skin tends to produce extra melanin and scarring around the area. And this can happen to the areas where the spots are treated. So this may be a case of being careful what you wish for because the scarring and hyperpigmentation left behind after having treatment may be just as bad as the original spots. So in some cases, it may be better to just leave them well alone. So if having heard all my warnings, you are still adamant and you're still considering having treatment, then I would advise you to find a dermatologist who is expert in treating black skin. There are many treatment options for DPN, ranging from having them cut or shaved off, using liquid nitrogen to freeze them off, or even using lasers. The cost of treatment can vary depending on the type of treatment and the size of the area to be treated. As DPN is not a serious medical problem, removal is usually done for what's regarded as cosmetic reasons, i.e. you just don't like the look of them. 
Therefore, if you want them gone, it's more than likely that it won't be covered under the NHS. You'd have to go and find a private clinic and pay for it yourself. So that's it, all done. Hopefully you found this video helpful. And if you did, make sure to click the like button so I can see it and carry on making videos for you. This video is part of a series of videos on skin problems. Make sure to check the full playlist and subscribe to be alerted on when I release new videos. In the meantime, thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.